popular poet with Poe. <laughs> Whilst I was shopping a flea market one day, an item stood out from the fray. Its shabby container was very deceiving, for the treasure inside begged my retrieving. Whoa! Oh, merchant, I quivered as my courage felt pale. Be a good chap and price this item on sale. I'll pay a king's ransom, just give me my wish. For I know this item is worth a lot. Ish. Much later, I walked home with bus money gone, clutching my prize and humming a song. For I had found something <laughs> so special and flat. A magnificent, stupendous, terrific bath mat. <gasps> No. Oh. I must have dozed off. What an odd dream I had. But you, though. <laughs> but I mean, really. Why would anyone recite a poem about a silly old unimportant thing like a bath man? <laughs> <gasps> Nice to let the person down easy. I love it. Well, not that easy. I love it too. It's a really unique style of filmmaking. That's exactly what I was going to say. Except I was going to say I like the squirrel. Yeah, that's not at all what I said, Len. So I'm glad I didn't say it. So does that mean you're choosing Misery to direct your rockumentary? Well, no offense, everyone, but Poe, <laughs> your three and a half hour reel Poe flew over the cuckoo's nest was. Inspired, but sorry, we didn't choose it. Inspired? Really? Iris, Ruby, Skullboy, Scaredy. Great work, but we just have to go with... Misery! Yeah, misery. Misery? 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 Yeah, she's just got the edge we're looking for. Congrats, Misery. You're a rockumentary director. I can't wait to get started. <laughs> Ow. I think you might be too close. Hi, I'm Misery. A while back, I agreed to direct a rockumentary on Frank and Len's band, Rip. I have, in fact, directed a few people in my life. Run! <laughs> For some reason, people tend to listen to me. But this is my first time directing an actual movie. Thanks for helping out, guys. Ruby is on sound. Hi. And Iris is running the camera. Hi. The footage we managed to get was something else. And I've seen my fair share of something else's. So get ready. For the rockumentary of a lifetime. <laughs>
So, tell us a little bit about how you two met and got together. Well, I knew I wanted to form a band. So, I conducted an extensive search for my band members. Hmm. Hey there! And then I found them. Hmm. We're gonna need a little more material. Maybe you need to get some shots of the guys in process. You know, follow them around and see what it's like. Cool! We're going on tour tomorrow. Wow, that's great. Where are you touring? Gloomsville. Doesn't touring usually involve going out of town? Technically. But somebody forgot to book us transportation. And somebody forgot to book us out of town gigs. Okay, well, moving on. Whew, boy, you guys really need a manager or something. Skullboy manager. Yeah. Well, you know, when they walked into my room, I mean, uh, office, you could tell they just needed someone to take care of the nuts and bolts of things, you know? The pressure was getting to them. Why are you talking in that weird accent? Isn't it great, Misery? I think I must be related to a long line of band managers because I'm pretty good at this job. What about the negotiations that occurred five minutes ago? So I just need to get a couple of shots of you guys rehearsing. Watch me negotiate, boys. I'm a master. Before my clients do anything more, they will require a large fee to be paid in licorice, red or black. They will need a cut of the profits for all Frank and Len dolls to be paid in licorice, as well as an unlimited supply of licorice in their dressing rooms. Huh? Ah, uh, <laughs> okay, you drive a hard bargain. We'll take nothing. Excellent. Good one. I had to be hardline, but you know, that's the biz. Whoa! <laughs> Did you guys always play rock? We went through another phase of music, but we don't like to talk about it. The other phase. Time for my tuba break, Frank. Ow! Oh, you okay, Frank? Ow! Guess that means no. We were experimenting. <laughs> Hairline fractures weren't exactly what I had in mind. Yeah, if they're not at least multiple transverse bone fractures, what's the point? You can say that again. What's that supposed to mean? How should I know? So, who would you say decides who is the decision maker for all of your decisions? He, he does. does. What? what? No, no I, I, I do. do. No, you, no, you don't. don't. No, you, you do. do. I, I do, do not. not. Stop talking at the same time. time. You stop talking at the same time. time. Hey, you know what we need? Um, a party. A going on tour send off party. Yeah, 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 a party! Careful with the camera, Iris. I'll take it from here. But. Oops. The party. Do like a do like a do like a do. Oh, so you're an agent now. Mm -hmm. Need an extraordinarily talented but modest singing crow on your roster? You know any? Oh, thanks for letting me take a break, Misery. That's okay, Iris. You should sit down. You look nauseous. Huh? Thanks for coming, everyone. I've got a surprise announcement. That's funny, Frank, because I have one, too. <laughs> okay, Len. Quit saying you were going to say everything I just said. Well, I wasn't going to say what you just said now. Anyway, people... Here's the new album cover design for Rip! That's not at all what I was thinking. I imagined our cover more along the lines of this. Yeah, that doesn't work at all. Well, it's better than your lame idea. <gasps> oh, yeah? Well, it had to be lame, Len. You're in the shot. <gasps> Misery, I think we should stop filming now. Okay, I just have one more question. Don't worry, I'll be careful. Guys, what do you prefer to go by? Frank and Len, or Len and Frank? Len Frank and Frank. And Len. What? That's being careful. Heh, 
We've always been Frank and Len. Other than the times we've been Len and Frank. Yeah, it's uh, just that Frank and Len has a better ring to it. Yeah, uh, maybe in your lame brain. <laughs> oh, yeah, at least I have a lame brain. Maybe it should just be Frank. Guys. To be Frank. Guys. Len sounds great to me to be Len. Time out. Fine. That's it. I'm going solo. Wait. I'm going solo, too. No. Stop saying everything I say. I didn't say what you just said then. <laughs> New announcement. The band's splitting up. New announcement. Cancel the tour. Does that mean we have to cancel the party? Misery. I know. Perfect tension to end Act One. <gasps> the recording sessions. I know what to say about rock and roll. I know what to say about it. What? Okay, Frank, can we try that again? And, Len, can you refrain from eating popcorn? If I have to. Guys, it's great that you're solo artists because you can really express yourselves. But you each have to be quiet so we can hear what the other person is expressing. Agreed? Agreed. Yeah. I know what to say about rock and roll. <laughs> Sorry. I know what to say about it. I know what I'm singing about. <sighs> Rock and roll is what I'm singing about. Nah, nah, baby, with the nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah, you are my <sighs> nah, nah, nah. Okay, maybe we should take a break from recording. You guys need to try and work things out. Yeah. You're right, Ruby. We'll figure out a solution. Yeah, we can't go on like this forever. So, we figured out a solution. Yep, we're dividing our space. You stay on your side, and I'll stay on my side. Ah! Len, I'm going this way. Good for you. I'm going this way. Len? Frank? Len? Frank! Boy. Skullboy, we've got to talk about your clients, Frank and Len. Misery, can you give us a moment, please? Uh, sure. Frank and Len are really not getting along. I know. I just got the tours back on track, but it's two shows, two dressing rooms, two everything. We've got to get them back together. I'll do whatever I can to help, Ruby. Can I confess something? Sure. Uh, Misery, do you mind? Oh, I'm not sure I'm managing very well being a uh, manager. Aw, uh, come on, Skullboy. You look like you're doing a good job to me. Nah, that's all myth and hype. I signed Poe on and promised him I'd get him a gig, any gig, and I can't seem to score anything. I'm sure something will come up. Maybe showbiz just isn't me. Oh, sorry. I have to take this. <laughs> sure. Yellow! Yellow! How's that gig coming along? Uh, yeah, great. Not to worry, something will come up. Oh, sorry, on the line's ringing. I have to take this. Yellow! Hi, hear anything yet? Nope, po, nothing yet. I'll let you know. Anything? I'll keep you posted. Whew, I need a breather. Nothing yet? No! What you doing? <clears throat> Just, uh, working out some notes. Hard being on your own? Yeah sometimes, but that's what being a solo artist is all about. You know, being solo by yourself. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you're going on tour by myself is, it's gonna be fine. I, I just have to, uh, What's that? Frank's sweater. He gets cold sometimes on buses. I guess I don't need to pack that. On the road. I just don't know how to get them back together. Don't worry, I figured it all out. I'm getting the hang of this management thing. Ah, oh, <gasps> Skullboy, there you are. I thought. Hey, how's my favorite client? Oh, well, I, I'm, uh, really? Yay, it's the band. I mean, Frank and Len.
or Len and Frank. Hi, guys. Hey. So you guys excited to go on tour? Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Great news, guys. I got you the best touring bus I could find, but you're going to have to share it. What? what? Just this once, and there's only one dressing room, too. But uh, trust me, it'll be fine. Well, okay. Yeah, uh, sure. Hey, there's your tour bus now. A fish truck? <clears throat> so what were you guys like as kids? Did you have any interest in music early on? Um, yep. <laughs> hey, whatever happened to that guitar? It was a xylophone, Len. That's the point of the story. Oh, right. I love that xylophone guitar. <laughs> Good one. Thanks. <laughs> hey, remember that time you dared me to glue my butt to my chair? We couldn't stand up for a week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't remember that. Yeah, me neither. It's gonna be a long ride. The Big Show. Um, can you stop pacing? It's making my hoof and mouth disease act up. Guys, I know you're nervous, but you're both going to be great. Thanks, Thanks Ruby. 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 Can you tell Len he should have some water? His voice always gets extra dry when he's nervous. Okay, Len, you should... Hey, Ruby, can you tell Frank it's okay if he goes first? I know he likes going first. Oh, oh okay. Uh, Frank... And Ruby, tell Len that on his guitar break, he needs to ease up on the third fret. It'll sound better. <sighs> Len... Ladies and gentlemen, Frank! That's you, Frank. Break a leg. Ruby, can you tell Frank to have a good show? And, and tell him, even though I can't be up there with him, I'll be there in spirit. Ruby, can you tell Len? Thanks, buddy. Now, that's great movie making. I... I know... I know... I know... I... I... I know what to say about rock and roll. Len, you're here? I know what to say about it. Rock and roll's what we're singing about. So I guess that means we're back together. I guess that means we're back together. You just said what I said, Len. I know. That's exactly what I was going to say. Documentary, Misery. Loved your unique style with the burning, smash and crash cutaways. And blurry focus technique. Cool. The what? Oh, uh, huh. never mind. Alone time with Iris. Oh, hi. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna have a little alone time now. Sometimes you have to make your own fun. Can't always rely on other people or a bunch of really wild and adventurously fun activities. Oh, uh, yes siree. <clears throat> nothing like enjoying your alone time doing nothing. Absolutely nothing. <whistles> nothing at all. <laughs> Yep, you, you just 
just got to sit back and <sighs> smell the flowers. Yep, you got to really smell all those flowers as much as you can. <laughs> it's so good just to relax and smell those flowers. And listen to those birds. <laughs> really sit back and listen to the birds. <laughs> Yahoo! Yep, nothing like spending time alone doing nothing. Time to let that imagination run wild. Oh, wow! Look at those stars! 